In the quiet embrace of dawn, as the first light of the day tiptoed through the curtains, Thomas found his solace in a ritual that bridged the gap between the tranquility of night and the bustling day ahead. The art of brewing coffee, a practice both meditative and invigorating, was his cherished morning ceremony. With deliberate movements, Thomas would set the stage for his daily brew. The grinder, with its promise of transformation, was the first to perform, turning the roasted beans into a coarse ground that held within it the reminders of distant lands, mountainous terrains, and sun-drenched valleys where the coffee cherries had basked in nature's bounty. The kettle's gentle whistle signaled the water had reached its perfect dance of bubbles, not a rolling boil, but a serene simmer, ideal for coaxing the flavors from the grounds. Thomas would then pour the water in a slow, deliberate spiral over the coffee bed, a practice that was less about precision and more about grace. The bloom, a momentary blossom of coffee grounds, released the most delicate of aromas, a prelude to the coffee's full symphony of flavors. As the coffee dripped into the carafe, a rich tapestry of aromas filled the kitchen. Notes of chocolate, hints of citrus, and mutters of nuttiness intertwined, creating an olfactory mosaic that promised warmth and comfort. Thomas watched the last drops fall, each a tiny, translucent jewel in the morning light. With his favorite mug cradled in his hands, Thomas would take his first sip. The warmth of the coffee spread through him like the rising sun, dispelling the remnants of sleep and filling him with a gentle energy. Each sip was a moment to savor, a reminder of the world's simple pleasures and the beauty found in the quiet moments of life. Outside, the city stirred to life, but in Thomas's kitchen, time seemed to stand still. There, in the communion of his senses with the coffee, he found a peaceful interlude, a sacred space where the complexities of life distilled into the pure enjoyment of the moment. As the day beckoned, Thomas felt ready to step into its flow, carrying with him the serenity of his morning ritual. The memory of the coffee's warmth lingered, a gentle reminder that even in the rush of hours, there remained the possibility for moments of quiet joy and reflection.